Hello everyone. Uh, today I want to show you my friend give me the uh, uh, little tank, like a round tank. And I have the fish in here, the only uh, beta. See it? They can swim around, like right here. Ooh, yeah. And I have another one that. Um, the goldfish uh, right over here only one left as the other video that you saw that I have a lot of goldfish and it's been racing for a year right and uh, over a year and then uh, suddenly all of them die why they die because I was moving them out to the uh, well instead of, of the tank the, uh, the um, barrel and then uh, suddenly the neighbors was playing and then I tell him, hey, be careful when you break this guy when I put it on the outside, right? So that morning went on, uh, the next day, all my fish died when I put them in the well outside um, where I'm gonna show you in a bit. All my big one, um, beautiful one, dead. When I get back home from work the next day, I don't see any more fish. All of them floated up die. They used to live in this barrel, and you see the hyacinth that I have grown. It. It's pretty good now, but there are no more fish in here. All of them dead. Um, it's pretty. So today, what I do, I'm going to clean up this guy and then give them one more fresh water. And this is the only goldfish that I um, have left. This is my beta. You see how it's swimming? So right now, sadly, I have only two left beside the beetas that I have raised in long time now inside the house. This well, I uh, used to place them on the other side. And when I get back home from work, I saw them all die. But it was full water. The fish, when I transfer it, you know how I transfer them to this water from the barrel to, you know, uh, clean up the barrel and wait for the water to steady to transfer it back. If anyone watching my video, they will know that I put the well right here, right? And my neighbor's house next door. There's a few boys that come out and play and they throw the ball into my size a lot. And I say, hey, be careful. You breaking my, uh, uh, what is it called? Uh, the round tank, the glass tank that my friend gave it to me. I was, I was putting them over here, so they throw the ball. That's why I told them, hey, you, when you play ball, you be careful because I have the, the, uh, um, tank here, you know, don't break it. So the time that I confirm them after work, uh, when we, we eat the fish, the food after work, and the time that I confirm with them, uh, right after work on that day, so the morning coming now, we still uh, give the uh, fish food before we have to work. So we give them two times food in the morning and, and in the evening when we get home. So in the morning, we give them food. Every of them swim and healthy, right? Because they've they, they been racing for over a year. So um, when after work and that night coming home, and we were checking and try to give them food again, and all of them floated. We didn't see the time that they do it uh, or anything, but we just have the story that we confirm with them that don't jump over and don't break the, the tank. But um, unfortunately, the water is very soaked and milky. Look like somebody throw something in the water. It's not clean anymore. And we clean them like more regularly, you know, like we do cleaning it and as I film in it, people seeing it that I always give them a clear, a clean look house. But after com com confirm with the, the boys, right? And then I think he he glares me like give me a really mean look. He didn't answer me or anything. So we weren't plan to mo buy more fish, so we tried to hide it in our side more than on that side, because we don't want the fish to get killed again, you know. Uh, but now they move, so I'm gonna. <laughs> Long story short, they move. So now I'm going to move the well back there. That's how I'm going to do uh, the cleaning for the well today and also the barrel. That's why I try to tell you why I do that. And and I, um, I want to tell you that all my fish, all my goldfish, beautiful goldfish will gone. Um, 
sadly gone. No one left except the other one, but that one is a new bot. It's not like uh, he have left any completely dead. And like I said, the water was soaking milky. It's I also have some chilies here, the red chili. I make the um, my roast rolls salad. I'm gonna get some fresh chili in so I can eat with it before I go and clean up the uh, all the barrels and everything else, okay? Pretty, huh? My uh, chili right here is provide a lot of fruit, a lot of chilies. So I'm gonna get some in uh, to eat with the salad because the salad, uh, we're gonna dip it with the uh, uh, tamarind uh, fish sauce. It's gonna be really good. So let's go inside and see how it is and then enjoy the salad with me before I go doing the work. This is the uh, one that uh, called Magosa salad. And I um, make them with the uh, pork belly and uh, tamarind juice. It's really good that I'm gonna eat this one for the salad today only, no, no cooking. I just made it, uh, but I have extra, so I'm gonna also make it uh, a full video for you to see uh, for the next video. You see how the chili, I just pick it right there. And then the, this is the uh, tamarind fish sauce that I made it, which are, and the salad itself is really good. Now it's ready to go and eat. Hello everyone. Hello. Uh, as you see me uh, introduce all of the fish and um, my salad. This one I uh, made it last night, so I didn't uh, film it, but I will film it for you to see completely how it looked, the, the vegetable. Uh, so today we just like go ahead and eat because usually sometimes you eat a heavy meal, sometimes you eat a light meal. So today we we just want to eat the salad, me and Tracy. Let's eat, okay? The the maca and the taro are play, actually playing right there. On there. So Tracy uh, is actually uh, uh, tied up. Um, uh, get used to it now, and then she okay to eat it because it's kind of a little bitter. It's a little bitter, not a lot, right? This is how it looks. The salad is really good, though. Deep. I see almost banging the, <laughs> the table. <laughs> hmm. The reason I say it because of the meat, not the <laughs> pork belly. So the pork belly, you eat with it. It's actually good. But this one, vegetable, it's super spot, super bitter, super bitter. That's why you see me put a lot of uh, of the um, what is it? Um, chili. What? Huh? Hmm. So we got this one. <laughs> deep, deep, deep. Mm. Nó nắm mặn được không? <cười> Má chàng ta rồi play. Mm. Vô cái gì? Yeah. This drink is um, bean sprouting, but the leaves, 
<laughs> it actually give really bitter taste in the mouth. But they say that it's really helpful for the lungs. And um, mm -hmm. and it's kind of... Um, when you eat it one time, you go, you're gonna eat the second time, right? So you don't want to eat too much of the leaf. You eat less the leaf and more the meat, <laughs> right? More the meat, please. Mm. <laughs> but it's really good. Not bad. You know, you eat the leaf from the tree. That's it. Có gấp không? Đâu, cũng dễ gấp nhiều tại vì mình không muốn gấp nhiều á. <cười> cái như cái lá này mình để dành mình ăn được mình chỉ cần bỏ thịt vô là mình ăn thôi mình đừng bỏ cái lá cái, bỏ cái, lá, cái lá nó quý this is a very rare vegetable uh, everyone mango bố mới làm mango đi làm khô mango với cái này với khô có sạch luôn so a video just show you that me and Tracy have our salad outside in the backyard. Now we go ahead and eat because we're gonna go ahead and go in front to do the the barrels and the well too. So uh, we will see you uh, over there in the uh, in the front. This is in the back. And I also have the fruit uh, rambutan. The rambutan is really um, sweet. I don't know if you eat it, but it's very popular now to everyone. how it looks inside. And you do it, eh? Mmm. Sweet. Mm. The seed. This seed. I'm gonna plant it over there later. So let me and Tracy finish this and then we're gonna see you in front, okay? We are now in front. I just blow dry it and then Tracy is gonna gather the trash before we can clean up the uh, um, well. Tracy already moved all the plants out well already. Now we just go ahead and clean it up. Now me and Tracy We clean it and it's clean already. Now Daisy try to uh, screw it back because the, uh, maybe when we hold in this one uh, and it's kind of loosen, huh? What about this one? Are they loosen them? They loosen them right here too. Is it? They loosen down here. Okay. Oh, no, this one is not young. And this one too. So we're gonna actually screw it, make sure it's uh, tied up. Now we're moving uh, it back. What do you Like this? Like this? One, two, three, boom! No, 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 no. Remember this one? Five. 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 Two in the water. I'll let the water run by itself. I'm gonna clean up the uh, uh, plants. 
so the water is still running over here and I'm gonna clean up this guy I'm gonna clean them up and I'm gonna wash them and then I'm gonna put it back into the to the welt and to the So this one, once in a while, you have to clean it up, or else it's gonna be dying, you know. And I think there is the things that are eating up this guy. No good. So let me finish it up, okay? And I will show you the result in a minute. I cleaned all them up already. Now I'm gonna wash them. In. Wash in this guy. This long one, we're gonna save it for the uh, barrel. I'm gonna just leave it in the corner. Gonna wash this guy for real. Look like I wash my vegetables. <laughs> we must show that we dip them beautiful like that. Some of them are nice, some of them are still not really clean. So I have to wash it before I place it back. Oh yeah, there's a trash. Maybe I'll just redo this one to see. Wash it a little bit more. Leave it there. So the big one is for the uh, for the barrel. The small one is for the well. Continue uh, cleaning it up, okay? I look like a shampoo the hair. I was cleaning up and then I see a lot of water. I think the uh, pool broke again. So much water. It breaking, did they say? Break the eye. Right. It's hard to be break if flat. Wow, it's floated everywhere. Look at this. The pool is not good. Oh my god, look at over there, Daisy. But I think that, what happened? Wow, it's all flooded. Look at this. All flooded right here. It's all flooded. Well, the pool is not good. It's, uh, it breaks again. And it's still going down. It's not, it won't stop, I see. Look at it, it's still going down, look. I don't know. I have to double check. It has to be somehow. The pool have the problems. Now we got to figure out what it is, why it flooded so much. Uh, I already finished the plant. 
and then this one too. I'm gonna go ahead and put it back to the uh, barrel. So now I'm gonna bring this guy back. It was flooded, it was scaring me. I was just washing this guy. I got the waters ready, clean now. So I'm gonna put this guy back here and we're gonna try to uh, go buy some more fish to put it back here for... Uh, we have to redo and start the beginning again. Mm -hmm. I guess time to say goodbye because I have to go back in, uh, in the back house, uh, backyard to go, uh, to check up with the pool to see what happened. Uh, I called my daughters uh, out for help already and then Lena to see uh, what's going on, why it broke like that. Uh, thank you so much for uh, enjoying our video for the day and I will see you for the next video. I will update it if I buy some more fish uh, to put into the barrel right here. Because I moved the barrel here for more uh, sake, and we're gonna try to get some fish. Okay, I will see you for the next time. Goodbye.